Hi, I'm Dylan from Velocity Tech Solutions, and today I'm going to be doing a video on the removal of a 2900 motherboard. So first things first, you'll want to have all your machine unplugged. I've already got that. So, we'll take off the top here. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is remove some of these cables that are blocking some of the components. So first we're going to unplug your RAID controller. You'll notice that um, it says controller 1, controller 0. That kind of tells you what port it will plug into, just for in the future when you reinstall these. Unplug the SATA cable. And at this point, you can raise up the front fan assembly. These are covering the procs. Next, we'll remove this rear fan assembly. And you'll notice there's two little blue tabs. You just pull them in and up, and it should come right on out. Now you could do this when the machine, with the motherboard either in the machine or out of it. I normally do it while it's in. I'll remove the procs. Then lift this lever. Then this should let you grab them out. Um, you'll notice that the easiest way to grab these is there's two little indents on the left and right side. You can kind of get your fingers around. Just be very careful about the pins. Well, we got that. Grab out all the memory. Alright, now there's a few more things we need to grab out before we can get the entire main board. First, we'll now take this entire rear fan assembly, this little blue tab, and just push it down and up, and it should just release. And then, you'll go at your RAID controller, which is mounted right here. Um, in order to remove this tray, you need to remove the RAID controller first. So the easiest thing is first, you take this battery out, it's being kind of secured with this right here. So unplug it. Then with the RAID controller, you kind of push back on both these blue tabs, and push up. Then the cable for the battery should come right through this little hole. It should release completely. Now next, to remove this cage, you'll notice there's this blue tab, and then this right here. What you're going to want to do is push that out so that it unlatches there, and pull this one up, and then towards you. And it'll release, and lift right on out. Now lastly, we just need to remove these cables, so the two power cables here. these two spare cables right over here. So now that the board is essentially all taken apart and everything on it, you'll pull up this blue tab, pull it towards you until it snaps, and then it shouldn't pull anymore. And then you'll notice these black tabs on this side that makes it so pulling it out and up is not really a very good option. It's the easiest way I find is kind of lift up from the left hand side and then out that way. And then that should be it as far as removing the main board on the 2900 or 1900. 